What's up guys, this is Coach Donnie with ElevateYourself.org. In this video, I'll be reviewing the A6 Men's Sky Elite MMFT Volleyball Shoe. I'm not sure what the FFMT stands for, so let's get right into the highlights. If you want to try your own pair of the A6 Men's Sky Elite or any other volleyball shoe, then shop at the official volleyball shoe headquarters at All Volleyball that has a huge selection of volleyball and basketball shoes as well as other volleyball gear and equipment. Use my discount code below to get 5% off your entire purchase and free shipping on all orders over $75. The last time I wore ASICS volleyball shoes was in high school, and that was my very first volleyball shoe. I never even thought about trying ASICS again, because Nike and Adidas were making so many great shoes that I felt like the original volleyball shoe companies like ASICS and Mizuno's were falling behind and not very innovative. It wasn't until the fans like you suggested that I try the ASICS Sky Elite shoe, and I'm very happy that I did because I can tell a lot has changed in 15 years. First, let's unbox these bad boys. I decided to get the red shoe because I wanted to change things up since I only get black and white shoes. The red is such a modern, vibrant color. The black and gold ones look pretty sick too, so you can't go wrong with either color selection. The Sky Elites required no break-in period and felt comfortable to play in right out of the box, and they fit true to size. I would classify these as a mix between a traditional basketball and volleyball shoe. Basketball shoes tend to be heavier, bulkier, thicker, and stiffer where volleyball shoes tend to be lighter, more flexible, and have a thinner sole. The Sky Elites are a little thicker and more padded than a traditional volleyball shoe, but still less than a basketball shoe. The upper has a medium stiffness, meaning your foot can still move and stretch the upper, but you will still feel some resistance. It locks your foot in place without suffocating it or making your foot movement feel restricted. The shock absorption is great, depending on your jumping style. The sole is thicker than the typical volleyball shoe, but also soft, which means you will feel your foot actually have a sinking feeling into the sole, compared to shoes with a stiffer and thicker sole where the rubber pushes back harder and your foot doesn't sink as much. So this is personal preference whether you like a softer or stiffer landing. The traction is one of the best I've tested in a long time. Sometimes it sticks to the floor so well that I end up tripping because my foot is still stuck to the floor, which is a much better problem to deal with than slipping due to not having enough traction. I never had this shoe slip even once which is very rare even compared to all the other basketball shoes that I've tried. I could change direction, sprint and stop immediately, and jump without hesitation. Even though the Sky Elite is a mid-top, the padding around the ankle is actually very comfortable and soft. This shoe provides a level of comfort and ankle support that is rare in my experience. My foot felt locked in without feeling restricted while also feeling supported with comfortable padded materials. I have wide feet and my feet feel pretty comfortable and a little snug. However, if you have very wide feet, the sides of your feet may feel too tight. So you might want to consider the Mizuno Wave Momentums instead, which are very accommodating for wide feet. I would consider the Sky Elite a jumper's shoe because the heel toe transition feels very smooth and easy to jump with.
the shoe does feel very springy even without any extra bubbles in the sole. The sole is stiff enough where you can quickly jump off the floor, but soft enough to absorb landing forces. The only downsides of the Sky Elite is the front of the shoe tapers to a point, so I do feel it rub against my pinky toe sometimes, but it's not enough to make it an uncomfortable wearing experience. Also, because the sole is thicker than the typical volleyball shoe, some athletes may feel that it's too high off the ground and prefer more of a thinner sole. In conclusion, the ASICS Men's Sky Elite FFMT Volleyball Shoe is one of the best volleyball shoes I've tried in a long time. It has the durability and padding of a basketball shoe, very responsive for jumping, and has one of the best traction for quick floor movements, all while providing a comfortable and secure feeling. This is one of the few shoes that I would actually recommend for all positions on the court. However, I would recommend against this shoe if you have very wide feet, prefer a very stiff or very soft upper, or need a thinner sole to feel the ground more. Thanks for watching this video. Let me know in the comments what your favorite volleyball shoe is and why. Make sure you subscribe to this channel for more volleyball shoe reviews, jump training videos, and other cool volleyball content videos. Thanks again for watching, and we'll see you guys next time.